in Boone. Uh, this is developed just in the last couple of hours. Miles Harris now live there uh, along Boone Street. Um, how are things progressing there? Getting worse, getting better, somewhere in between? Oh no, Ben, it's definitely uh, getting worse. The rainfall has definitely picked up here and even just the last five or 10 minutes, which isn't good when you're looking at roadways like what we're seeing here in downtown Boone where that flooding is just continuously making its way through downtown Boone here. This is actually just right across the street from the Watauga County Government Center. So as you can already see, some cars are actually kind of bracing what we're seeing right now when it comes to the flooding. But what's so dangerous about that, we even see it looks like some students even walking across the street here, is that the roads uh, and really the flooding when it comes to that rain, it's just so murky and you you can't even see the roadways here and even on our way out here we saw very similar situations here with the flooding on the roadways and what's challenging about that whether you're driving or even walking you don't even know what is in and on the roadway here so you've even been able to spot a couple of things that are poking out on the roadways and some things you cannot see so again if you see things like that you've heard Sarah say it do not try to drive through these conditions if you see this along the roadways here and we have seen it really all throughout Watauga County here we've been driving through um, not just Boone here but we've also made our way through Sugar Grove We've also made our way through Blowing Rock as well in very similar situations here. And if it's not the flooding, it's the downed trees. Um, as far as power, it's not really clear if there's any power available in this area here because all the doors, all the businesses around here, they're all closed. Nobody's inside when it comes to that at the moment right now. But guys, definitely a very intense scene when it comes to the flooding in downtown Boone. And this is something that we continue to keep a close eye on. Uh, ben and Sarah, so toss things back to you guys in the studio.